ladies and gentlemen welcome to today's call of duty video guys today we are going to be leveling up the a94 i finally have it unlocked it's only level 15 though i really did not want to play shoot the ship again i wanted to mix it up and go to like hard point or something but i was using this a94 on stream last night and with these attachments these are all the attachments i really have unlocked it's honestly not that great of a gun right now because it's just like such a slow like it runs slow aims in slow the iron sight kind of sucks on it so we're just gonna pop on a double weapon xp today and we are going to just run some shoot the ship just so i can all i have is a 30 minute i only wanted to use a 15 but whatever we'll pop a 30 minute and i just want to get this bad boy leveled up as much as i can especially because shoot the ship is you know going to be leaving today's monday tomorrow's tuesday so the next update is coming very soon i'm just gonna enjoy this while i can get this bad boy leveled up so then the next stream which is going to be the next confirmed stream is going to be wednesday night if i'm not mistaken so that's the next confirmed stream and i want to have this bad boy leveled up so we can give it another go on some search and destroy i know shipmate can get pretty boring to watch especially over and over especially when i die so much i'm gonna turn down my headset because it gets really loud and i always every time i play shipment i always have to adjust the audio levels but i mean i i just popped a 30 minute double weapon xp i don't even have like i literally i mean, might only have time to play just this one game i don't know if i even have time to play a second i'm really grateful that this is a gonna be a full game here but let's just let's just play and uh level this bad boy it's not a terrible gun a94 is not terrible so far however it's just not the best the iso uh to my surprise is actually i think it's a pretty good gun like i haven't when i played search last night on stream little we didn't pull out the mp5 at all i don't think from maybe we pulled it out for one life when like a team was talking like a lot of crap and they were destroying us but even when i pulled out the mp5 we still got destroyed by that team so i, I don't think that had anything to do with the iso at all something totally unrelated to call of duty this morning i relearned how to drive a six shift and that was um pretty cool i would say like before if there was like an emergency so stick shift i mean by a car by the way manual shift for those of you who don't have like a license or don't know because i know that like there's like talking about a manual stick shift car these days is like not existent everyone has automatic i mean i even have an automatic you know i've never owned a stick shift myself but i knew how to drive a stick shift to where like if there was ever an emergency and i had to drive one i could but this morning i actually i woke up <laughs> we finished the stream last night at midnight I went to bed at 1, probably going to fall asleep until 2, because we got our first Fall Guys win last night, and that was awesome. Thank you, Tig and Nate, for helping me with that, and thank you to everyone that was in chat with that. Uh, Fly Fitz was in chat, and I think that's why we won, because it was his first time in chat in a while. And I'm not, I uh, should not have said that. It sounds like I'm calling him out in a bad way. I'm not. But, so, end of the stream, probably went to bed at like 1 or 2, had to wake up at 6.30 this morning to uh, drive somewhere and drop something off, and I had to relearn how to drive a stick. And it was, uh, it was like, it's relieving to know that, like, for sure now, you know, if there was ever emergency that happened, then I could definitely drive, like, the stick to, in that case. And also, I kind of, like, I was thinking about, I was talking to Taylor, my wife, about it. If I ever find a car that's, like, a stick shift, and it's pretty cheap that someone's trying to sell, just be, and no one wants to buy it because it's a stick shift, I wouldn't mind owning a stick shift because... It, it like so it's easy to drive when you know how to drive it but if you don't know how to drive it it is like people are not gonna be able to steal that car is what i'm trying to get at here like if anyone were to break in you're not gonna be able to steal that car unless you know how to do it and the people who like know how to like how to drive a stick shift and are that determined to steal the car then at that point you can just have it but i mean if you're that determined to steal a car and you can drive a stick shift i would assume that you're a little bit older because like i said in today's world like i've never owned a stick shift i've always had a automatic car so that was pretty cool i think i'm pretty sure we ended the stream last night uh on a search and destroy loss like that one when i was telling you i switched to the mp5 for just like a second because we only lost one search and destroy last night which was awesome we won a ton, ton of games in a row and uh, because of that i'm pretty sure that my skill based matchmaking is pretty low because this lobby i'm in has been the easiest shipment lobby i've ever played in i mean i i feel like i'm actually gonna go like uh, I don't want to say double positive, but I'm actually, I feel like I'm going to go, like, actually positive right now. So, I haven't been keeping up as much with all the Cold War Easter eggs. I watched the first, uh, the first one that Noah J did, which was incredible that him and that community were able to do that. Like, that is so awesome. So, I watched that one, like, the recap video when they were done, and then I watched the one that started, what day was it? The tw Oh, I mean, what day? I don't know. Friday, I guess. I don't remember. Whenever the first, because I know we're like on a six or seven day stretch of Easter eggs now. So whatever day one was, I actually watched 
like all of Noah's J stream through that and that was like really cool to watch I haven't watched these last like two or three days now I'm not really sure how far behind I am which is fine as I can just catch up on those and as a matter of fact it's a lot easier just to watch the 10 minute like recap oh I suck I should have killed that guy it's a lot easier to watch the 10 minute recap on those Easter eggs but they're super cool and I like I really really have like insanely high hopes for Cold War now uh, before I know that like for Call of Duty you know in my opinion I've said this before the worst Call of Duty, in my opinion, a terrible Call of Duty is still better than basically every other game. So I will love Call of Duty no matter what, if it, as long as it sticks to its core, obviously as much as possible. Like even the Jetpack Call of Duties, not my favorite, still played them. And then like for Infinite Warfare, I just played Modern. I played Modern Warfare Remastered just because it was available. But if Infinite Warfare was only available, there was no Modern Warfare Remastered, I would have played Infinite Warfare, you know. But this year, because of this Easter egg, like the, how do they have a close streak? But because of they put in this much work into this amazing easter egg that is like combining warzone with black ops 4 and all this like my i try to i try to keep my standards like pretty low that way just in case it is like somewhat bad i'm not disappointed I, my my standard or my hype is so high right now for cold war i mean dude look how much work they're putting into the easter egg which is something that like you don't even have to watch like so people like my uncle who like to play call of duty just casually they have he has no idea anything about any of this he doesn't know any youtubers he doesn't know any streamers he doesn't know anything about this he's still gonna get wait, wait that's a bad guy that was a bad guy i think he's still gonna get the trailer just like everyone else is and that's so awesome like everyone's still gonna get the trailer but they made it so if you want to you can be a part of this easter egg that is just like a ton of fun and i i'm like so happy about that i really am like it's gonna be i think it's gonna be a really good year i see that kill right there i i switched off him try to go to the next guy but i feel like the a94 is just slightly slightly underpowered it also just could be because i suck though this has been without a doubt my best a94 game though so far because every time i like at the beginning of the stream yesterday when i was using the a94 in search i don't think i went positive one time thankfully my teammates carried me to victories like i said we won basically all of our games last night i just spawned right in front of that guy what a punk now I just realized the score. I was not paying attention to the score. I was so excited to talk about Cold War that I stopped paying attention to the score. Can I? Dang it. I was really hoping I could finesse that third guy and just get a get on the point here. Oh, I'm so tired of being flashed. I got a I got a grenade kill there. Can you guys get on the hill just to stop the time? What is this? I was just talking about how this is my best game with the A94 and I'm getting smoked. I haven't even been able to touch the point. No, I gotta kill. I can't even kill that guy. Wow, dude, that sucks. Okay, well, never mind. Still, though, by far my best high in 94 again. Let's check the. We dropped 49 kills. Okay. I got play of the game. Not that surprised. Also, guys, for all those who are, all you who are still in the video right now, I just want to thank you guys for joining the Discord. 49 and 36, we killed it. I want to thank you guys for joining the Discord right now. We are 62 members deep right now, and we've only had this Discord for like three days. That is absolutely insane. I like, I genuinely did not think that this would happen, or at least not this fast anyway. That is amazing. And another, I want to do another big shout out to Etros. He has donated like the first day he donated, I think five times. And then yesterday he donated four more times during the stream. That is absolutely incredible. Thank you for the support there, Etros. And uh, let's see here. If you guys are still in the video now, what's going to be the secret phrase that you guys can leave in the comments below? To let me know you're still watching let's make it let's make it hawkeye h-a-w-k-e-y-e -E, because last night on stream we used the crossbow a lot look at this disrespect class this is my disrespect class that because i just unlocked the crossbow finally and i was having a lot of fun with it so hawkeye is going to be the comment down below tweet it at me leave it in the comments whatever you want to do do it to both this is the a94 setup we were rocking today oh we finally have stock unlocked so this is going to be the new AN94 setup until we unlock more stuff. If you guys use code EMGG on GFIELD right now, it is 30% off again. I think this is the third week in a row. If you do cans, it's only 20% off. And then also use code EMGG as SCUF, MetaThreads, and DX Racer. Thank you guys for stopping by today's video, and I'll see you guys all in the next one. Goodbye.